That is Archer third with the Archer report. And gosh, Mr. Archer, it's, we've been really frustrated lately because, like, we we just we came back to wrestling and, like, the last time we were here, Pride was rude and he was throwing fire at people, and that's uh, no one. No, knows. That was dangerous. But but we've been we've been wrestling that other place, and uh, we we can't seem to get any wins, and it's it's really frustrating. And, <clears throat> it's frustrating. Damn straight, it's frustrating. That is what the hell. I don't what work if, at the other what? place. I don't work at the other place anymore. You know that. We get put in the same match every si- See what I mean? He's just- uh, He's so frustrating sometimes. All he cares about is wins. He, we were having really good wrestling matches with the with that Mars kid. He's super good. And then now we're here, and we're supposed to be wrestling a lumberjack that doesn't seem to know where he is. We, we, disappeared. We, yeah, I've looked for him all night. Have you we, seen him? We haven't seen him yet. We hope okay, so Larry's okay. We, we like him. We remember him. And, and Mo Jabari, we're, we're not sure on him, but he's a pretty good wrestler too, right? He just made a match at the saddle, though. Oh, that's right. Yep. We were there too. Yeah. This match is going to be real good. And can you can you talk to Pride for, for us? Because we really think that the fans, they might like him if he would just stop being a dick. Okay. Is he? Pride, 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 pride. Listen here, okay. You gotta quit being a dick. You get more fly, you get more flies with honey. You get more shots. You get higher up the ladder with a little bit of sweetness. Have, have you been listening to him? No, it, it, no, 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 no. He's, he's, he's gullible. He's a moron. You, you've led him around and done whatever you wanted for how long? But sometimes you gotta compromise. Sometimes you gotta work on the side of that to get what you need. And all I'm saying is maybe change things up a little bit. You might get some wins here in Love Wrestling. Make a lot of sense, Thaddeus. Just saying. Hopefully the Lumberjack shows up. We love punching him in the face. And yeah. Mo Jabari. We feel like we're gonna like that too, so. Do me a favor, when you get him in a hole, just like pull back his hair and show his giant bald spot on the back of his head. Oh, yeah, that is right. That'll really hurt him. Oh, yeah, the Lumberjack's bald. Oh, that is yeah. awesome. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Jack off. That's not going to work. Archer out. Your unrivaled source for backstage, the locker room, and beyond. I'm Thaddeus Archer III, and this is The Archer Report. Rich King, Rich King, my very good friend. Great to see you here at Love Wrestling. Tonight, you face a man who, he's kind of been a have you been a thorn in his side? He's been a thorn in your side? I mean, you're friends, but you're kind of not friends. Mitch Clark. Yeah, uh, you know, we, we've kind of thorned each other over the years, right? Well, that doesn't sound right. Uh, scratch, scratch that part. Okay. <clears throat> Anyways, um, you know, we have a past. We have a history. Uh, we've faced each other multiple times. I haven't beat him yet, which kind of really, really sucks. So you're hoping to beat him? So tonight, right? tonight you know, we, we got matched up initially. Spencer said, you know what, this is going to be a great match. To be a wonderful match, and then last week I kind of bumped into him, broke his phone, and then you know me and Ty interfered in his match. We thought he won, but uh, he got disqualified. So you know I don't think I'm facing magnificent Mitch this tonight. So I think it's going to be more dangerous old Mitch, or which like is malicious Mitch. Malicious Mitch, and you know, that's a terrifying thing. You know, he's an evil son of a bitch. Like a, yeah. But you know what? You know what? I'm not going to sell myself short. You know, I've been training a lot. You know that. I'm always in the gym, baby. Dude, so I'm never going to downsell myself. I believe that I can beat Mitch Clark tonight. The power that I have in this shape cup, the protein shape, and the power I have up here. If anything he can do, I can do better. Well, I believe I'm Rich King. I believe you're Thaddeus Archer. Yes. And I kind of love you. You're awesome. Rich King is going to go out to there tonight and kick Mitch Clark's ass. Mitch is going to cry like a little baby. You're just going to mess him up. Like He's going to be on the ground crying, like sobbing. Anyways, Archer out. Good luck. Archer out. Great match. It's going to be a great match. All right. I got to ask you. Have you seen Larry? I like ran throughout this entire venue trying to find Larry. Uh, have you checked the local landfill? Because he's a garbage monster. He's a garbage monster? No, I have not checked the local landfill. Like, Oscar the Grouch, but more homeless. He kind of does look like Oscar the Grouch. kind of smells like Oscar the Grouch. Yeah, I think he got a... I think... Tomorrow, man. I don't got any time to go to landfill tonight. It's going to be dark. Though. He's like the Lorax of garbage. Is that a Seuss thing? I, I eat green eggs and ham. 
Are you high right now on <laughs> green eggs and ham? Anyways, I am here tonight with Danger Zone Mitch Clark, Marvelous Mitch Clark, okay. Malicious M Mitch Clark. Mitch Clark, you last month won the submissions championship. Are they still allowed to use that here or still carrying that? It doesn't matter. You tap. hurt people. You make them tap. I have one job. Break limbs, put people to sleep, make people tap. You know, you can call me magnificent, marvelous, malicious, danger zone. You can call me just Mitch if you're not in the whole, you know, brevity thing, I guess. I don't know. But Mitch works. But, you know, last time I beat up Leo London. It was like Mike Tyson versus an infant. Tonight will be no different. I can tap anyone out, especially on this roster. I'm the best at putting people to sleep. Tap you out, tap out the cameraman. Tap him. Yeah. Take his, rip his sleeves the sleeves off and choke him out. Perfect. But tonight, Rich. Rich. He's your friend. Rich King. I mean, your colleagues. You've known each other. Are you going to tap him out? Or are you, is he going to... <laughs> How dare you? That's what How you dare you? Sorry, Mr. Brown. Question mark. Anyway, the fact that you can even like speculate that he can beat me is ridiculous. Now, I might like Rich, or I might not hate Rich, but the big thing to remember is I'm here to win. I'm here to propel myself up the ladder and show that I'm the best. And I do that by putting people to sleep, making them tap out. And tonight, it will be Rich King that taps out. And then you're gonna break his phone, pay him back for breaking your phone, right? Yeah, yeah and then I'm gonna write dicks on his truck. Actually, they're I just, they're actually true, a bunch of dicks. Yeah, me too. Yeah. There's so many dicks. <laughs> so many. They're everywhere. He loves dicks. They're Anyways. anatomically correct. Very much so, dicks. lots of veins. But Very Rich dicks. Clark, thank yeah. you so much. Thank you so much. Good. I'm not even gonna say good luck out there. You're gonna make the man tap. I know you are. Okay. Mitch Clark, Rich King, two close friends, two colleagues. Tonight, what's gonna happen in this match? I don't know, but I know both men who are gyrating behind the camera at me right now are gonna hurt each other. Archer. Look what happens when we work together. Ugh. Yeah, Pride. We, you, you were on the same page as us, and they were cheering for us. They were cheering for you, Pride. Ugh. Yeah, they were because they cheer for the best, and that is exactly who we are. We've been talking about proving and showing to everyone exactly who we are, who we were before we left, and now at Love Wrestling. Jack Pride, we are on the same page, and every last one of you hmm, better watch out. I mean, you have to crank it so hard. Hey, you know, I get the neck, I just see red, go to sleep, you know, it's just the way things are. You give me your neck, I'm gonna do that. I'm I mean, sorry. You broke the hold like the second you tapped. I like, know, fair. God damn, man. You Cranked it on there like the name is boys, 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 boys. Larry, what the f man? I've been looking all over for you. Man. I posted literally the entire city. Man, people in Saskatoon were asking where Larry was. Seriously, BC man, I've been reaching out to everybody. Where have you been, dude? Man, I've been stuck up on northern Manitoba working on the ice roads. Man's got to eat, brother. You get it. Hey, like, man. hey, 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 no one gives a sh where you've been. What happened tonight? Didn't you lose? Maybe you needed some competition to freshen things up. Some competition. Some competition. Are you stepping up to the plate, Mitch? <sighs> okay. You know what? I'm going to make some phone calls. Winners win. And you do whatever you do. You know, Larry, the competition stuff he's talking about, he's right. This is going to be a chizoo, isn't it? A what? Chizu. T.Y. Is that Ben? Ben, how do you get me in Calgary?
God, the choreography. Oh. <laughs> 